More than a week after his passing, another tribute to the late actor Angus Cloud has been revealed. On July 31st, it was announced that the Euphoria star, 25, had tragically died at his family home in Oakland when a statement from his family was released. His passing came just a week after he buried his father in his native Ireland, who passed away following a short battle with mesothelioma. And now the streaming service, HBO Max, home to Euphoria, the show he starred in, has added a brief tribute to the actor. Viewers will now see that the first episodes of season one and season two of Euphoria feature a smiling photo of Angus at the beginning, along with the caption, in memory of Angus Cloud, 1998 to 2023. The streamer also mourned the loss of Angus last week in a statement, which read, We are incredibly saddened to learn of the passing of Angus Cloud. He was immensely talented and a beloved part of the HBO and Euphoria family. We extend our deepest condolences to his friends and family during this difficult time. Meanwhile, when Angus's passing was announced, his family released a statement which touched on how the actor had intensely struggled with losing his father, who he buried a week before his death. The statement also mentioned his mental health struggles, with his family writing, Angus was open about his battle with mental health, and we hope that his passing can be a reminder to others that they are not alone and should not fight this on their own in silence. At the time of his death, Angus's passing was viewed as a possible overdose by police officers who attended the scene, and days later, his mother spoke out to put any rumours to bed that claim her son's death was intentional. Taking to Facebook, Lisa Cloud penned, Friends, I want you all to know I appreciate your love for my family at this shattered time. I also want you to know that although my son was in deep grief about his father's untimely death from mesothelioma, his last day was a joyful one. Providing an insight into his final hours, she added, he was reorganising his room and placing items around the house with intent to stay a while in the home he loved. He spoke of his intent to help provide for his sisters at college and also help his mum emotionally and financially. He did not intend to end his life. Lisa then recalled how Angus told her that he would see her in the morning. I don't know if or what he may have put in his body after that. I only know that he put his head on the desk where he was working on art projects, fell asleep and didn't wake up, she explained. Lisa went on. We may find out that he overdosed accidentally and tragically, but it's abundantly clear that he did not intend to check out of this world. His struggles were real. She then spoke of how some social media posts have suggested his death was intentional, before urging that is not the case. 